Eulogies for Nigeria's first female combat helicopter pilot, flying officer Tolulokbe Arotile, as she is buried in a colorful ceremony in Abuja. The late flying officer, who was mistakenly hit by a vehicle belonging to her former classmate at the Nigerian Air Force Base in Kaduna, was buried with full military honors. In attendance were high-level government dignitaries, including the governor of Kogi State, Yahya Bello, and his wife, the Chief of Defense Staff, General Gabriel Olunisaki, the Chief of Air Staff, Air Marshal Sadiq Abubakar, the Minister of Women Affairs, Pauline Talon, and several others. Tolulokpa showed exemplary skills too difficult to emulate. As a child, Tolulokpa had always dreamed of flying a plane. At that age, her, inspirations, her aspirations were glory. But today, we can gladly all testify to the impact she has made not only in the Nigerian Air Force but among family members, friends, colleagues and the entire nation. The Nigerian Air Force is still in palpable shock and grief on this loss because it is the loss of a mentee whom the Nigerian Air Force has so much confidence in and our expectations have been cut short. As a combat helicopter pilot for several years, I can tell you that this young and confident first female combat helicopter pilot in the history of the Nigerian Air Force braved so many odds to get to where she was before her demise. As a service, we had so much expectation for Tolu which she was already living up to with ease. Though she is no longer with us, I must say that her short stay with us was highly impactful. <laughs> 